As you can see, trucks are coming in and out of here all the time. This is one of the temporary sites that Lee County set up where a lot of debris from the hurricane is brought initially. From here, it'll be processed, loaded on new trucks, and then sent to disposal sites, landfills, other places of the state, and that's where it gets really expensive. That was from a trip I took over to Lee County last week as I investigated a debris removal contract that was going to raise the rate to haul debris outside of the county from five cents a mile to $40 a mile. Lee County commissioners approved the deal in a three to two vote, and that single line item could add tens of millions of dollars to the cleanup efforts, and all of it being paid for by the federal government, in other words, you and me. Since our story broke, we have learned there are efforts by the state and others to force changes to that contract. We will stay on top of this story and let you know what happens. Well, that's our show. Thanks for joining us. We'll be back again next week at 8 a.m. for another one-hour edition of Facing South Florida. Until then, stay safe and enjoy the rest of your day.